Hello, so today we're going to uh, have the unboxing of the Sony Short Throw Projector. And uh, I've never really understood the appeal of the unboxings. It's just opening a box. I guess it's like watching someone else open their Christmas gift and you don't get it. But, uh, you know, we'll try to make the best of it here. So here's the box. And here is our trusty blade. So let's get started. So I'm going to carefully open the box, as you can see. And we'll get to the projector. Okay, oh, this is the wrong box. Okay, so let's see what we can do here. So naturally, we have to be careful with safety and whatnot. This is the insider's box, the projector. Again, we'll do the blade here. Let's see if we can cut right through that. Okay, so, yeah, uh, try that again, yeah, uh, so slowly and carefully open the top of the box with your sharp, very sharp knife, as you can see, and let's see what we have inside, oh, there we go, so, we have a big, Thing my bob. Take all this out here. The white tower. Okay. The instructions. And lots of the cool things you can pop. Okay. Alright, so that's it. It's unboxed. Hope you enjoyed that. That's what it looks like. So I suppose you want a little bit more than that, at least to see what's in the, the white casing here. There's instructions, so let's, let's keep going. Very nice monolith. This is Sony on it. And let's see if we can figure out how to open it. Now, ooh, voila, there it is. This is the projector here, I guess. Pretty small, pretty good weight to it though. And uh, some instructions, which we don't read. And some other paperwork, which you look at later when you're really frustrated, you can't get it to work. And then there's some more stuff in here. Naturally, I'll never be ever be able to put this back together again. Still feels a little heavy, but I don't think there's anything else in here. Let's see if your compartments. Okay. And then finally, oh, okay. More pieces. And more instructions, which we don't read. Right here. And more cords. Lots of cords, lots of plastic, and more cords. And then another empty box. So that's it. So now we are unboxed. This appears to be the. Uh, unit which you plug in your uh, HDMI to. There's two HDMI, well there's one HDMI in, one HDMI out. I thought this was wireless. I'm not sure why you need HDMI out unless it's a pass through to a different device. And then you have your uh, IR blaster so you can use the remote. Is there a remote? I don't see a remote. Maybe that's the blaster for the unit you're connecting to it. And your power. So one of these is power. So, um, on this side here is the projector unit itself. Uh, the only input is the, uh, the power on this side. And then this is, uh, I don't know. So we're going to figure that out shortly. And that's for your uh, IR blaster. This is your IR blaster unit to receive um, connections from your uh, remote control. Okay. So uh, I'll be back. A little bit after I heal up here, and uh, we'll try to turn this thing on and see what happens. Okay, thank you.